All right, guys, just came back from Lidl and I wanted to show you a little bit about what we were able to take home for under $130. And in New York, I have to tell you, this is a pretty great buy. We saved $5 with a coupon. We did save $5 with a coupon. And also, just really quickly, um, we did not think about anything we were picking up. This was a no, this was a grab whatever you want because we're still getting to know the supermarket purchase. So you will see a lot of snacks and treats. Let's get started. We picked up some cereal, frosted flakes cereal, and then some oat loops. They're this, not the one you know. They're different ones. Yes, they are They're different. Cheaper. cheaper version. We're giving a lot of the store brand options a chance even the kernel uh the sweet corns these were 39 cents a can my husband uh picked up some sardines he wanted to give them a shot i got lots of seltzer i think they were around 50 to 60 cents a bottle even the tomato ketchup it was again i think it was like under a dollar yeah it was 99 cents strained tomatoes again it was somewhere around a dollar I mean, I was just picking up things thinking to myself, I have to try this for under a dollar. These are the sweets I was talking about. Uh, they had Belgian waffle cookies, they had wafers, and then they had wheat biscuits. I grew up eating cookies like that, so I wanted to pick that up and see how it was. Store brand cold cuts, pre-cut, pre-sliced, ready to pick up. I just wanted to give them a chance. So, um, 0.38 pounds, they were uh, $2.28. Uh, why not? And then we have here also little thin crust pizza, and we have some butter. These kiwis were really cheap. How much were the kiwis? Three, three bucks. Three dollars. Yeah, I think they were under three. But we have the um, apple strudel pastry. I picked up some pierogies. We have premium Pilsner beer. So then we picked up this um, submarine dressing which you just put on your sandwiches, um, nice and easy. This was again, super cheap. Cantaloupe, uh, some stir fry General Chow's. My kids really like General Chow's. I, that's probably not gonna be so good to be really honest with you. We live in New York, our Chinese food is pretty awesome so anything frozen doesn't really add, uh, add up but I gave it a shot. My son picked this out, uh, caramel and chocolate ice cream bars. Instant oatmeal, this was like $1.50. Uh, we have some yogurt, again, organic roasted garlic pasta sauce. This was super cheap, maybe around $2. Tart cherry, I figured I could put this in a slow cooker. Some fresh bread. Of course, we had to get some yogurt. My, my son is dying to try this. Dying to try this tasty cake. He is dying to try this tasty cake. Uh, French toast. Sticks, another purchase from him. He wanted to give this a shot. I picked up pretzel bites, pretzel rolls rather. These were uh, $2 and change for, for the pretzel bites. In the Italian section, they had bruschetta crisps, which we love. Um, huge, huge pack of cheddar cheese. And again, we have the pasta. We have the long pasta, which we picked up during the last video. And again, um, I had salsa last time, I think. I picked it up again, it was pretty good. We have two different types of applesauce, great prices. Uh, tangerine cold press, which I will have some right now. Even this tomato paste was what, 39 cents? Mm. Something, yeah, it was like 40 something, 44 maybe, maybe 39. It was very, it was less than 50 cents. Less than 50 cents for tomato paste. I got a few dips. Uh, spinach dip and then guacamole both from the store brand this was the most expensive thing that I bought today but I just love the mixes and I'm actually going to mix them together these were about eight dollars each but they're organic so for trail mix though I thought that that was a pretty good price but again this to me was the most expensive thing that I had so this whole thing this whole table was under $130. We had a $5 off coupon. Oh, and the tortilla chips. I don't know if I mentioned that and the glue. But all in, $130 under. We had a $5 coupon for New York. This is really great. I mean, I'm, I'm really excited. We don't have any meat because our we have three freezers filled 
with meat, and we do not need any more meat. We use Purdue Farms for, Thanks, um, Farm. yeah, we use Purdue Farms for delivery for meat. So we typically don't need to pick up meat for when we go food shopping. But this is quite a haul for us. And uh, I'm really happy with this store. So I'll let you know when I um, give some of these new products a try and I'll keep you posted. All right, we have a brand new mop. My husband picked it up. It is called an infused mop. And he is gonna put it together. So let's check it out. And then you're pressing the handle. Press the handle. It comes out of the front. That's the solution. So. What happens if you push it? Oh my! Clean. Look at that. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. cinnamon muffins and my little guy is gonna give them a taste mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> tastes like cinnamon look who else wants to try the muffin I should have put chunks of apples in the apple cinnamon I'm so upset it was a missed opportunity Liam it was a missed opportunity Everything in the garbage, I'm starting over.
my fire Trying not to bend my fate I'm tired of fighting Saying things we don't mean You know I don't like it When you're packing your back And turning your back Calling me a liar Calling me a liar Trying not to let my feelings get to me Sometimes I can't let them go So now I got these walls to say Now I got these walls to say Feeling like I'm all alone, you don't seem to want me Even though you told me so And baby, I wonder If we should just go in separate ways We could start over We could start over Trying not to let my feelings get to me Sometimes I can't let them go So now I got these words Now I got these voices.